Hi everyone, welcome to Evie's Toy House and today we have a Miraculous Ladybug dress up set. So it's too bad this came out after Halloween, but this looks super cool. So if you like to dress up as Ladybug, this is a great set to get. It comes with a mask, we have your yo-yo, we have the earrings, the Miraculous, we have Tiki, and take a look, we even have an Akuma. And it says this one changes colors. Here is the back of the box. It's so pretty. And we have a new picture of Ladybug. A lot of these packages reuse the same image over and over again. So I think it's cool that this one has a new image. All right, let's get it out of the box and check it out. Here is our first item. This is Ladybug's mask. And as you can see, this one is actually made really well. This is plastic, but it's flexible, so you can adjust it to the size of your face. And it has these little hexagons grids all over it. So this is very realistic to the show. I believe Ladybug's outfit looks very similar to this. And it gives it a very nice texture. And I think this makes it look very high quality. So taking a first look at the back here, the elastic looks very short. I think this would only fit a small child. However, this mask is big enough to fit an adult. It does fit me, just not the elastic part. So you can easily fix this by snipping off this elastic and replacing it with something else. You can use a ribbon, another piece of elastic, or maybe even a thicker string. All right, next we have Ladybug's yo-yo. So this yo-yo looks really cool. It is a uh, hand size, so this is really easy to grip. And the front and the back are a little bit different. So the front here has a little line right down the middle and the back does not. And over here in the middle, there is a string. So this is a little yo-yo. Look at this, isn't that cool? String is pretty long. I'm not a yo-yo expert, so I wouldn't know if this actually plays really well, but it seems long enough to play as in yo-yo. Of course, you do not want to throw this at anyone at any time. And there is another feature here. It looks like... Oh, this opened! Oh my goodness, look at this! Isn't this cool? Oh wow, this must be where you fit the little Akuma. So let's take out our little Kuma. Okay, so our Kuma is here. It has the little plugs here to fit it into this little groove. Oh my goodness, this is too cute. And I think this changes colors. So I don't know if it's heat activated or it needs to be in ice water. So it seems like just by holding on to it, it does not change color. All right, let's test it out. I have some hot water here and some ice water on the other side. Let's take our little Kuma. Oh, look at this, it turned white. That is so cool. Here we go. Isn't this neat? Of course, as it cools down, it becomes purple again. Or we can just dunk it in ice. Oh my goodness. That is super cool. So let's watch it again. Go straight to white. And then back to blue. <laughs> super fun. All right, next, let's take a look at the Miraculous. I like how it comes in a little jewelry box. All right, and these are just little clip-on earrings. They're completely made of plastic, so I would guess these are actually quite fragile, so you don't want to be too rough with them. It seems like these are just really easy to wear. You just clip them onto your ear, and um, gotta be careful so that they don't fall out. These are also pretty big, so it'll be pretty obvious when you wear them. And our last item here is Tiki. Oh, look at her. <laughs> Her head is so big. So she has huge blue eyes, a cute little smile, two little antennas on top of her head. I think she's supposed to have three, right? And a tiny little body. So she's in a sitting position, which is good because if she was standing, she wouldn't be able to stand at all. Let's see if she can actually sit properly. Yep. So she can sit. <laughs> there we go. 
and she looks better than the previous Tiki. So this Tiki came in a previous playset, and as you can see here, she doesn't look as cute. I think this Tiki looks more like the one in the show, whereas the other one is a little bit more uh, serious looking. However, take a look, this Tiki is missing some spots. So she has two spots on the sides of her head, and I think she's supposed to have a tail too. So this Tiki, the new one doesn't have a tail. Oh no. So they got some things right. I like the eyes. I like her smile. I think the antenna is cuter this way instead of stuck to the head. But she's also missing her spot and her tail. And I thought she had a spot on her body too. Alright everyone, so here is the playset. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. The mask looks really high quality. We just need to swap out the elastics for a bigger head. This yo-yo is really awesome. I really love the kuma and how it changes colors. And I also love that this is actually a real yo-yo. The earrings are okay. Um, they're not uh, made with the highest quality. It does seem pretty loose. However, you want to be careful because it looks like it would fall very easily. And last of all, we have Tiki. So Tiki overall looks really cute. It's just too bad that it missed out on some of the details. Alright everyone, so what do you think of this playset? Let me know down below in the comment section and I'll see you next time. Bye!